Hello, everyone. Welcome into the pregame report. I'm your host, Molly Sullivan, joined by Keith Byers, who knows a thing or two about playing here in Philadelphia. You did it all for the Eagles, and you left everything on the field. If we zoom into your time under head coach Buddy Ryan, what was it like with those teams? Oh, it was an honor to play here in Philadelphia, you know, for being a Buddy Ryan's first draft pick way back in 1986. But it seems like yesterday, you know, to me, uh, one thing a buddy required out of everyone is to play with passion, play with heart, and that's a reflection of the city of Philadelphia. Uh, they, that's what they expect, and you know that's what they were going to deserve, and that's what they got. You know, especially you know out of me, and uh, that's what made it really special to have the opportunity to be here. Yeah, and off camera we spoke about Buddy Ryan being a leader, Doug Peterson being a leader, and fearless. You're also part of the Eagles' 75th anniversary team. Uh, that was an honor voted on by the fans right behind us, the oh, fans of Philadelphia. Yeah, as a as a player, from a player perspective, what is it like to be recognized in that way? Oh, it, it is something that's real that I hold dear to my heart. You know, and I'll have it with me you know, for the rest of my life, because nothing against the media, <laughs> you know, <laughs> that, those are great awards and they know what they're doing, they write a great story, but when you get honored from your fans, the people who really know that they're, and one thing about Philadelphia fan, different than every other sports fan in America, they're the most knowledgeable, they're the most passionate, and they're the, that's what makes them the best, and, not, and so when you get a recognition from the Philadelphia Eagle fan, that means you've really done something because they're going to be honest with you and that reflects what the city is all about. Yeah, that's what we're all about. And you're part of the media now, so enough with that <laughs> nonsense. Hey, coming up at the halftime this afternoon, Clyde Simmons and Seth Joyner are going to be inducted into the Eagles Hall of Fame. You played with both men here in Philadelphia, so give us the scoop. What makes them <laughs> Hall of Famers? Uh, they, they're well-deserving. You know, we came to Philadelphia in the same draft class way back in 1986, and uh, it was really a pleasure and an honor, you know, to be here today with them, to help them celebrate, you know, going into the Hall of Fame. They're well-deserving, and, you know, to see them what the fans didn't see, which each and every Sunday, they got to see the finished product of their work, hard and labor throughout the week. And, you know, I've seen those guys come in with busted ankles and sore shoulders, but I'm like, man, you're going to be able to play Sunday? Yeah. yeah, somehow, I'm like, yes, I know we got a chance if you guys are going to be out there with me. And, you know, they, we started off together as teammates, and we formed a, a, a friendship. But at the end of the day, we're all brothers, and the love will always go there. Football brought us together, but nothing will ever tear us apart. And so I'm glad to be here, not only, you know, for the fans and everybody, but to be here with my brothers. Yeah. So I love them, and I'm glad for wish the best for everybody. Yeah, and that's coming up at the half. Keith, thanks, thanks so much for your time. Oh, my pleasure.